Okay, we're going to do something a little different now. We're going to do um, a challenge run. Um, I don't remember what the thing was, and hopefully somebody will post it quickly, but um, otherwise I'm going to start with draft, because I like draft. Oh, we want the ending, too. Got to kill the heart, or else it doesn't count. Uh, was it diverse? I feel like diverse plus draft is, like, really easy, though. Oh, um, but you also have starter deck, huh? Well, I don't like certain future, so I'm going to skip that one. Um, yeah, let's try a diverse draft. I don't know. I, I feel like diverse draft throws even more power into the, the draft phase, so I don't think I like it. Um, Maybe like binary. Binary makes the run a little bit harder. It's probably not enough. Okay, so like binary end what? Um. What about the one where you like lose HP every floor? Terminal. Terminal kind of uh, accentuates the um, uh, the same problem, right? Because it's like you um, well, if you do all red, you die on floor two because you um, you start with one max HP and then you lose one max HP, and um, so that's uh, doesn't quite work. Um, Uh... <laughs> um... It's funny because like all these red ones, they they like they act like they make the game harder, but they don't actually. Here, maybe lethality. Oh wait, no, we we did a lethality uh, watcher run before, and it did not make it harder. <laughs> it made it easier. Um, maybe deadly events. It's funny because like all of them like sort of make the game harder, but sort of make it easier. Except for one hit wonder, and one hit wonder just absolutely annihilates you. Um, okay, let's just do let's just do draft and one hit wonder, and see if we can survive that. Um, and we'll probably have to try this a couple times because uh, we're gonna get killed on floor one. Uh, you want deadly events too? Sure, whatever. <laughs> okay, so this is our first pick. Um, let's do... Um, let's do Empty Fist, try to do some stance changing stuff. Ooh, Fear No Evil is excellent. Alright, excited about that. Wheel Kick's great, so there's Foresight. Um, it's weird that the um, the one health modifier doesn't show up. You just start at one, and it pretends that it's a normal run otherwise. Um, we need to pick a lot of defensive stuff, or else we're going to die. 
Let's do wheel kick. Wheel kick's good. Uh, I'll take a second empty fist, sure. Ooh, and a second empty fear no evil. Oh wait, empty body though. Uh, no, so I think all the things that take max HP, if you have one, are free. So you can become a vampire and a ghost and it doesn't cost you anything. Uh, but it's possible they round up randomly and, and they take your one HP. Uh, but that wouldn't be very fair. Okay, so we've got um, one of the major problems with doing draft on a watcher is you don't start with either of the stance cards. So you don't have any way of entering calm or vigilance. But we found two copies of Fear No Evil. So we're pretty good on that. Um, I guess we're just going to pick like all the Fear No Evils and Empty Fists. Um, there's the Flurry of Blows we we're looking for. Um, talk to the hand is great. Now we have a way to block. Uh, protect is good. Inner Peace is also good, though. Uh, I think we need Inner Peace to power up all these Empty Fists. Fasting is probably a bit ambitious, but here's another way to enter Calm. Okay, here's some blocks. Great. I think it's probably Deceive Reality over Third Eye. We don't really have any Scry Synergy currently, and uh, this gives us a way to retain safety for later. Uh, Mental Fortress is a great way to block, and we really need ways to block. I'll take that. Um, I think No to Worship, but it's between Third Eye and Empty Fist. I could see both of those. Um, we need more block. All we have for blocking right now is Talk to the Hand and Deceive Reality and Mental Fortress. Um, uh... We already have, what, four copies of Empty Fist? No, three. But it's going to feel like a lot, because it's a 16-card deck. Um, so I think we take third eye. Ooh, Wallop is great. Um, yeah, we, that Wallop's another way to block, too. We don't have any way of entering Wrath or Divinity, which is when Wallop really shines. Um... But hey, if it just makes us survive, that's fine. Uh, I think we want fourth Empty Fist. Great. Okay. Well, this is going to be hard, um, but that's a great deck. Um, Alright, so... More likely to contain elites, also more likely to contain treasure rooms. Well, we need elites, both elites and treasure rooms, because we need to find Mango. <laughs> if we want to survive... We need to find Mango. So, um, let's take a bunch of question marks, I guess. And then maybe we can buy a Mango here. Or like a waffle or something. Okay, do we die on turn one? <laughs> um, uh, we might kill him. Oh wait, no, we block for, we only block for eight, so that's not enough. So we either kill him or die. Um, we'll get to play all the cards in our hand, so I guess we'll do that. Yeah, we die. A lot of drafting. A little bit of dying. <laughs> okay, I think that's kind of how it's going to be, uh, so we got to try again. And we're going to keep rotating while we do this, just for fun. Uh, okay, so we're going to draft, ending... Um, no, I, so I responded to your challenge. I don't, I don't like it um, because um, uh, draft is already really strong, and diverse makes things really strong. Diverse is a really good modifier. Um, so I don't want things that make draft even better. I want things that make the game harder with draft. So I'm not going to do that challenge. Uh, and then one hit wonder. Deadly one hit, the ending draft ascension. Yeah, that's it. Okay, cleave is great. Um, sure. Uh, reckless charge is great. Um...
Um, so, okay, so the problem with Starter Deck is um, it's unfun. Like, it does make the game harder, but it also makes the game just, like, less fun. Uh, if it's, I, I liked the thing you did in the past where it was you had Starter Deck and Vintage, so it was like, at least you got some, some rewards for... Uh, for doing fights, but if you make it so that it's just like, you just have starter deck, then it's just like, well, I guess I just avoid fights now. Um, and then you end up sort of dying a miserable death. Um, and so you end up like trying to, at the draft phase, build an act three deck and then you fail. And then like, okay, so maybe it's hard enough, but it's just, it doesn't make the game fun. Game balance is difficult. I don't, um, I'm not saying that necessarily there's a solution <laughs> that I'm asking for. I'm just saying that um, some things are fun and some aren't. Um, uh, Reckless Charge, I think. I mean, we only have one card and it's Cleave, so. Uh, we're probably not picking t enough strikes for that. Uh, I guess second Cleave? Sure. Uh, I wish that one of these was a defend, because these are all bad. Clothesline's kind of a defend. Um, hmm. Yikes. That blocks. Headbutt's really good. Iron Wave also blocks. Um, we are pretty desperate for block because we have one health. So I'll take Iron Wave. Um... If we're going to block for a bunch, Body Slam makes a lot of sense. Maybe I should have taken that Entrench earlier. Uh, probably not, but maybe. Uh, did I pick a Clothesline? That was stupid, because Weak doesn't do anything. We have one health. Weak doesn't block. Uh, I guess I'll take Warcry so that I can more consistently find block. Um, I should take Evolve, but I won't take it over Iron Wave, because otherwise we're going to die. Uh, we have Wild Strike and Reckless Charge, so Evolve is already good. Ah, hell, let's just take it. Um, <laughs> this seems like suicide. Um, weak does make your other cards block better, that's true. Um, people are correct. Uh, I guess Thunderclap, we need to kill people really fast. Uh-oh. Uh, Havoc maybe blocks? We're not finding enough. Um... I guess third cleave is okay. Um, if we can't block, we might as well kill people. Okay, there's another iron wave. I guess we'll just collect iron waves. Well, this one's gonna die for sure. Um, maybe we go to the shop and find a mango? I don't think we can afford a mango yet, but... Um, so we can ghostly armor and block out this turn. Um, can we actually kill him? So if we wild strike him... Yeah, we actually can kill him. Save the ghostly armor. We won a fight. <laughs> uh, fire breathing's... Like, we're doing the evolve thing, so I guess fire breathing could work. Um... Battle Trance, I think, is probably the card, though. Okay, well, let's Battle Trance. Oh, wait. If we... Yeah, we, that does not require you to draw. Okay. Uh, I guess it's Havoc. Cool. Oh, Cleave did more damage. That was a mistake. Uh, we have to Ghostly Armor to survive this turn. All right, two fights down. Maybe you just have to punch people really hard. That's the solution. Uh, Dark Embrace works with um, Reckless Charge, but it's kind of expensive and doesn't do very much. I think we skip here. Do we get a Mango? No. Um, Dark True Grit's good though. True Grit Metallicize, we can afford both. We could take a Block Potion, too. Or we could take a... I guess we can't afford Metallicize and Block Potion. 
Um, yeah, I think true grit metallicide is reasonable. Um, I don't know what I'm expecting to get from these question marks, but maybe lose one HP. So it does take, it, they do round up. Um, so these events will kill you if you're at one, uh, which is pretty brutal. I thought they'd be free, but they are not. Um, uh, let's take a face. Oh wait, there's a face that kills us, right? Wait, no, hold on. Faces are really good. Because one of the faces gives you health. Um, I have to look up face trader every time I see it. Um, yeah, raise your max HP by one after each combat is an option. Okay, so we have to pick this. So we're definitely doing a face. Give me the good face. Oh, that's a bad face. Uh oh. Um, I don't think we can block for 12. I think this is the run. Um, Max block is clothesline iron wave, and it is not enough. On to silent. Uh, custom button. Draft ending. And one hit. Deadly events. Okay. Uh, dash is great. It does all the things. Um, yikes. <laughs> what is this garbage? Um, hmm. This is not what I was looking for. I do not know what to pick here. These are all so bad. I guess I'll take prepared. Uh, noxious fumes is is good at doing damage. Piercing whale is good at blocking. Silence are pretty good at blocking. I think I'll take the, the noxious fumes. Give us a way to win. Acrobatics draws into block. Um, footwork versus piercing whale. We don't have enough time to set up footwork and stuff. We'll just take piercing whale. Uh, deflect blocks. Um, we'd have to take it over Bouncing Flask and Crippling Cloud, though. Those are both pretty good. Yeah, I mean, maybe Silent is the best at this challenge, because you get to draw extra two cards on turn one, so you don't die on turn one, typically. Um, which is nice. I think Bane over Finisher. Um, we did take a discard Acrobatics. So we could try to do Tactician. Maybe we should do the modifier that, that replaces your uh, relic with a, um, with a, a whatchamacallit, um, a unceasing top. That'd be fun. Yeah, I'll try Tactician. Um, backstab's great. Um, this one's rough. I guess Poison Stab does the most damage. Um. Hmm. Uh, Quick Slash can draw us into block. We don't want two Noxious Fumes, so I'll take another Deflect. Um. <laughs> I guess if one Tactician is good, two is probably good. Don't at me. Um. Uh, hmm. We have poison, so we can take Bane. It should be our second Bane. Makes sense. I think we need another prepared if we're going to pick tacticians. Well, that's something. Um, we go to a question mark and then a store after three fights. Seems like a reasonable route. Possible Mega Elite later. Um, 
I forgot we were doing deadly events. <laughs> yeah, thanks for immediately adding me. I appreciate it. Um, that's kind of the joke, right? It's like you're always being added if you're on stream. People have got you on blast. All right, I think I'm going to go this way. Oh boy, and we're going to die on floor one. Uh, actually, we have dash deflect. Um, I guess let's see what's in the box, too. Okay. Why did I take Tactician? <laughs> what was I thinking? Such a bad card. Okay, well, we survived floor one. Through sheer gumption. Uh, escape plan is good, right? We have lots of, like, zero-cost stuff. And we need to, like, get card draw? I wanted to get, like, backflips, but I didn't see any. Um, so let's pick escape plan and then get backflips later. After these guys kill me. Uh, Piercing Whale almost blocks out. Piercing Whale deflect does. Let's see what escape plan says. I block from there. I guess I can keep the backstab and just double Bane. But I like leaving one at six, though. Alright. Dash, quick slash. We've survived floor two. Concentrate. No, we don't have Unceasing Top. We can't pretend we have Unceasing Top until we do. We just don't. Alright, they are not attacking. That's helpful. Um, <laughs> we've got all the tacticians, apparently. Um... Sure. Quite a turn. Uh, choke seems good with the kind of stuff we're doing. Playing a lot of cards. Some of them are called prepared. Okay. Haha! <laughs> this one costs zero. Yes! Two free upgrades. This is why we do it. This is this modifier is great. Look at this thing's free. Normally this event's terrible. Now it's great. Tactician plus. My wildest dreams have been satisfied. Oh, there's a waffle, but we can't afford it. Oh my god. Um, that is tragic. Um Jesus. I can't believe that happened. Uh we can afford finesse reflex. I guess that's this deck. Sure. Uh, there's not really any point in going to a fire, so I might as well just go to two elites. I guess I could get an upgrade. Upgrade the reflex. Reflex seems super good in the deck. Yeah, we're doing lots of discard stuff. Tactician, reflex, you know. Um, sure, let's fight an elite. Okay, I was going to say that we can wait until we set up Noxious Fumes, but we got Noxious Fumes right now. Um, so we can't really wait, so we'll just do damage down. <laughs> it's pretty hard to imagine beating a 112 health Logavulin with one health myself, but I guess it could happen. Draw some more cards. Uh, we probably want to liquid memory something. Um, 
like the prepared or the dagger throw. I guess dagger throw is just strictly better than prepared. Uh, we could also go get the dash. But if we dash, we die. So let's not do that one. We're probably using the power pot this turn too. Um, okay. What do you got? After image is great, but it's not enough. So we're gonna die. Maybe if we played it at the beginning of the turn. Whap. Uh, yeah, go ahead and uh, and try it out. Type some type some bot commands. Um, ooh. Uh, Mewtwo made me do it. Mewtwo made me do it. I love it. Okay. Took me a long time to read through all the wiggly letters. All right, let's do a watcher version. Uh, okay, so we're doing draft and the ending. And then deadly events one hit wonder. Do we want to add in um, Inception? I talked about that. Um, it seems like maybe we need a little bit more more uh, added. Oh, you've added something to the Twitch Center's custom API. Um, look at you, man. There's a bunch of stuff. Um, uh, <laughs> it looks like Streamlabs is not uh, interpreting that command as a command, but rather as a string. Uh, no, we'll just try it. Try it again with the with the thing. Uh, just looking kind of box. Um, okay. Uh, third eye actually does. Um, I skipped defect. I'm sorry. Sorry, defect. Didn't mean to skip you. All right, let's go. Uh, cold snap box a little bit. Skim is also good. Uh, compile driver goes well with the cold snap we just picked. Steam barrier actually blocks though. Um, let's pick compile driver first and then steam barrier. Okay. Glacier, that's great. Um, we could rebound our glacier. Uh, or just leap. I think leap needs to be in here somewhere. Uh, these are all bad, so I'll pick recursion. Hmm. Cool head kind of blocks. Didn't work. Um, did you find it from like a... a or did you find that sequence of commands from a tutorial or something? Um... I guess cool head, it's fine. Loop is great. Um... Can you link the tutorial and I'll, I'll take a look at it later? Um, or you can put it in Discord or whatever. You know how to reach me. Um, yeah, is I guess Barrage? I don't know, who's the boss? <laughs> like, I'm gonna get to the boss. Um... Maybe Melter's better? Hmm, hard to say. I'll take Brush. Hologram blocks. Um, stack blocks, but it's kind of bad early. Like Sweeping Beam. 
White noise gets you barrage sometimes. Or, uh, barricade is what I mean. Um... Yeah, I'll pick white noise, sure. Uh, we've picked a lot of barrage stuff, so maybe ball lightning. Ooh, Glacier again. Okay, great. We've got two copies of Glacier. feel like that puts us in a pretty good position. Maybe take two fights and then go left. Somebody wanted to see the cat earlier. I don't know if they're still around, but here's a cat. She's decided to make herself available. Um... Looks like we're getting killed on turn one here. Um, oh, she's putting her claws into me. Uh, maybe we cool headed and draw glacier. If we draw glacier, do we survive? Um, seven plus two frost, plus one frost. So that's a. Uh, Six from there, 13, no, we die. <laughs> we die, exactly. Um, charming. Uh, maybe if we can develop... Hmm. Yeah, something crazy has to happen. So we either have to get it out of cool-headed or white noise. So let's look inside cool-headed. No, wait, let's look inside white noise. Um, hmm. No, white noise can't possibly save me. Maybe cool headed into there's glacier like I was talking about. Yeah. I guess I just die. Um Alright, I'll look in white noise. Electrodynamics maybe would have done that. But it looks like we're dead here. All right, this challenge is kind of depressing. Uh, I think that's probably it for the stream for today. Um, 